There are places in this world that appear to be practically alien, as though they could just exist on a planet that advanced independently from our own. These are places that researchers have needed to battle just to see how they actually could have been shaped, as they seem to follow logical laws that exist nowhere else on this planet. Hello guys, welcome to another episode of Forever Green. In this video, we explore the 10 weirdest places on planet Earth. And you should stick around for number one, as some of these Earth's weirdest places have stories behind them too petrifying to even dare visit. Number 10. Red Beach of Hormuz Island The Hormuz Island, situated in Iran, has a mountain rich in red oxide soil, called Gelak, which isn't only an important mineral for industrial purposes, but local people likewise use it as a zest in their cooking for sauces and jams. This mountain is the sole consumable mountain on the planet. The island is dry, and throughout the late spring months, the temperature can ascend to more than 43 degrees Celsius. The mountain, being on the shoreline, makes the curiously red seashore and red waves of the ocean an unmissable sight to see. Moreover, strolling along the shore, you will experience parts where sand sparkles with metal mixes and are particularly hypnotizing at dusk or dawn. The Red Seashore's red soil has a high financial worth and has been traded for quite a while so as to use in different businesses. For example, coloring, beauty care products, glass and pottery. The soil shading around you continues changing as you walk or ride, and you can visit a novel red palatable soil and other 70 bright minerals in Hormuz Island. Brilliant perspectives, immaculate nature, and different attractions all in Hormuz Island are the heavenly highlights of this delightful island. Winters in Hormuz Island are agreeably gentle. You can appreciate numerous stimulations, ways of life, conventions, attire, and nearby dishes of the south of Iran when in Hormuz Island. Number 9. Lencios Maranhenses National Park – White Sand Dunes Structures Every year during the rainy season, Brazil's Lencios Maranhenses National Park treats visitors to an amazing sight. The question still remains as to how were these sand dunes formed with their thousands of clear blue lagoons. At first glance, it looks like a picture-perfect desert, miles and miles of sand with almost no vegetation. But it's not a desert as Lensois Merhansis gets about 47 inches of rain yearly, making it too rainy to be officially considered a desert. Two rivers run through the Lensios Merhansis. These rivers push sand from the interior of the continent to the Atlantic Ocean, depositing thousands of tons of sediment along Brazil's northern coast. During the dry season, especially during the months of October and November, powerful winds from the equatorial Atlantic whip the sand back inland, carrying it as far as 30 miles and creating the vast, sculpted sand dunes for which the park is famous. From the months of January to June, the area is flooded with torrential rainstorms. Rainwater pools in the valleys between the dunes, creating thousands of crystal clear lagoons with some as wide as 300 feet and as deep as 10 feet. Although these lagoons exist for only a few months a year, they are not devoid of life. Interconnected lagoons link up with neighboring rivers, creating channels for fish to enter the temporary pools. Other fish, like the wolffish, spend the dry season dormant, burrowed far enough under the sand to reach still damp mud. When the wet season comes and the lagoons appear, the wolffish emerge to feed on insects and other fish that make the lagoons their summer home. And if you think this place is not that weird, the number one will leave you in awe. Number 8. Danakil Depression, the place with acid pools. In a surreal landscape of colors, dominated by luminescent ponds of yellows and greens, boiling hot water bubbles up like a cauldron, whilst poisonous chlorine and sulfur gases choke the air. The Danakil Depression in Ethiopia is petrifyingly scorching hot and one of the most alien places on Earth. Danakil is part of the Afar Triangle, a geological depression in the remote northeastern part of Ethiopia where three tectonic plates are slowly diverging. There are two highly active volcanoes and hence the vibrant colors are a result of rain and seawater from the nearby coast being heated by magma and rising up. The salt from the seawater reacts with the volcanic minerals in the magma, creating dazzling colors. 
in the hottest and most acidic pools, sulfur and salt react to form bright yellow chimneys. In cooler pools, copper salts create bright turquoise. The sulfur springs of Danakil are a particular draw, with its stupefying shades of neon green and yellow that hiss forth from the rocky terrain set on a vast sea of nothingness. Unfortunately, it's common to see dead insects and birds around the perimeter of Danakil's sulfur springs, which is likely caused by drinking the water or inhaling too much of the carbon dioxide rich air. It's also the reason the springs have been dubbed Killer Lakes. Before we move on to our next weird place, leave us a like, smash that subscribe button, and turn on notifications, and you'll win 10 years of incredible luck. Number 7. Pamakali Turkey Travertine Pools Travertine, a mineral consisting of a massive, usually layered calcium carbonate, is formed by deposition from spring waters or especially from hot springs. In the southwestern Turkey is a region known as Pamakali, famous for its snow-white limestone springs. It is famously known as a city that has been a spa town even in the ancient times. Dribbling gradually down the immense mountainside, mineral-rich waters froth and gather in terraces, overflowing falls of stalactites into the smooth pools underneath. Legend has it that the developments are solidified cotton, the region's chief harvest, that giants left out to dry. Here, there are 17 heated water springs in which the temperature ranges from 35 degrees Celsius to 100 degrees Celsius. The travertine pools attract millions of tourists who travel from all the corners of the earth just to have a bath in these warm and antique healing waters. It is believed that Aphrodite, the goddess of beauty, usually had a bath in these pools. Tadpoles can be found in the pools. Hot air balloon flights are also available at the dawn. Number 6. Pancake Rocks – Natural Staircases Near the settlement of Punakaki in Patai area, New Zealand lies the spectacular pancake rocks. These rocks with pancake layering make delightful attractions as well as what resembles a natural flight of stairs. These rock shapes were framed as the ocean had disintegrated and eroded through the limestones, when minute lime-rich sections of dead marine animals were deposited on the seabed and at that point overlaid by more fragile layers of delicate mud and clay. Spectacular views, geological oddities, and coastal forest, rich bird life, and marine mammals are highlights along this walk. Number 5. Cat Island What is too many cats? In case you're a cat darling, you may think that it's ideal to be in the company of a cat. Yet, would you be able to envision that there is an island in Japan with more cat inhabitants than people? Japan is known for the charming and what could be cuter than cat and little kitten faces. In Oshima, Japan, and an excess of a hundred felines lurk the island, twisting up in deserted houses or swaggering about in the peaceful fishing town. The cats outnumber people six to one on the island, and you are probably wondering, where did all these cats come from? The felines were initially introduced on ships on the grounds that the fishermen needed to manage a rat issue. However, the felines at that point stayed on the island and replicated. The populace expanded exponentially. It is not a spot with helpful transportation as just two rounds of ships go to the island every day. In any case, it may be a destination to attempt a visit for the amazingly sharp cat darlings. There's no vehicles, inns, eateries, or in any event, candy machines on the island. Inhabitants there are generally elders. They won't dismiss the guests who need to draw near to the felines, but try not to upset the occupants on the off chance that you visit the island and don't take care of the felines since they are taken care of by the inhabitants consistently. Number 4. Sailing Stones See the stones moving Heavy rocks like these seem to slide across the surface of Racetrack Playa in Death Valley National Park, California, without the gravitational phenomena. Located in a remote area of California's Death Valley National Park, the hefty, heavy stones seem to move across the dried lake bed known as Racetrack Playa, deserting a trail behind them in the cracked mud. The rock's apparent movement has been accused on everything from space aliens and magnetic fields to pranksters. 
but no one has actually seen the rocks move, which only adds to the puzzle. The sailing stones of Death Valley continue to baffle park visitors and scientists alike. However, in 2014, scientists believed that they had made a breakthrough on the mystery behind the moving stones, some as heavy as 100 pounds. The movement of the rocks occurs when large sheets of ice a few millimeters thick and floating in an ephemeral winter pond break up on sunny days. Frozen during cold winter nights, these thin, floating ice panels are driven by wind and shove rocks at speeds of up to 5 meters per minute, and thus credited the movement to a balance in ice, water, and wind. We may think we have found the answer to their movement, but who knows what other secrets lie in Death Valley? Pay a visit and see if you can come up with your own theory on this great phenomena. Number 3. Son Dung, Cave Vietnam Located near the Laos-Vietnam border, Hang Son Dung is the largest cross-section of any cave worldwide. Formed in the soluble rock limestone, it is the largest known cave passage in the world by volume. Its name, Hang Song Dung, is variously translated from Vietnamese as Cave of the Mountain River. The whistling sound of wind and the roar of a rushing stream coming from the cave can be heard through the entrance. Permits are required to access the cave and are made available on a limited basis, with 1,000 permits available for the 2019 and 2020 season, which runs from February to August. After August, Heavy rains cause river levels to rise and make the cave largely inaccessible. The cave is unique for the two enormous dolans, cave roof collapses, and underground rainforests, as well as home to the Great Wall of Vietnam. Number 2. The Stone Forest The Stone Forest is a notable set of limestone formations about 500 kilometers located in the Yunnan province, China. The tall rocks seem to arise from the ground in a matter with many looking like petrified trees, thereby creating the illusion of a forest made of stone. One of the most famous attractions is the Ashima Stone, which legend says was formed after the beautiful Sani girl Ashima ran into the forest and was turned to stone after being forbidden to marry the man she loved. Every year on June 24th, the local Sani people hold the time-honored torch festival which features many traditional performances such as wrestling, bullfighting, pole climbing, dragon playing, lion dancing, and the Oxy Moon Dance. Number 1. Easter Island The Easter Island is located in the southeastern Pacific Chile. Easter Island is most famous for its nearly 1,000 extinct monumental statues called Maui, created by the early Rapa Noi people. Being a high volcanic island, the inhabitants used basalt stone to carve the huge statues from the solidified volcanic ash of Ranu Raraku Volcano. And that's it for the 10 weirdest places on planet Earth. Which of these places would you like to visit? Let us know in the comments below. And if you like this video, you should definitely check out our video on 10 times animals messed with the wrong opponent.